Other sports tonight, great matchup in high school field hockey had defending Class A state champion Biddeford hosting Massabesic and both teams entered the game with perfect records. Biddeford led 2-0 at the half, but Massabesic would battle back in the second. Isabel Herbert scores off the penalty corner to cut the lead down to 2-1. Then 13 minutes to go, Andrew Schneider hits the shot off of Biddeford defender and Massabesic ties the game at 2. Mustangs then with a chance to take the lead, but Biddeford goalie Abby Nadu snakes the stop there on the penalty stroke. Just more than a minute later, Biddeford putting on the pressure and Carly Lovejoy scores the go-ahead goal. The Tigers hold on from there for the 3-2 win to stay unbeaten. Chevers and Gorham both battling for one of the top four playoff spots in Southern A. Chevers taking a 1-0 lead, but Gorham's Faith Dillon tying the game up with the second effort late in the first half. Gorham adds two goals in the second half for a 3-1 win. Over on the soccer pitch, the unbeaten Chevers girls hosting Wyndham. Wyndham goalie Riley Sylvia punches the Chevers corner kick. Attempt to air it in the first half there, keeping it scoreless. Then Wyndham, a great scoring chance. The Chevers keeper gets cut out of net, but defender Julia Ryan able to clear the ball away, and Chevers wins 1-0. Battle of goaltenders in Falmouth as Falmouth's Jordan Wolf and Thornton Academy's Madison Ayers keeping the game scoreless throughout regulation, but Devin Quinn scores in overtime to give Falmouth the 1-0 win. They have lost only once so far this season. Portland boys hosting Massabesic late in the second half. Kia Dilmany with a nice pass to Josh Motalicia, uh, who settles the ball and finds the back of the net for a Portland goal. Bulldogs win 7-1. They are now 7-3 on the season. In the gym, Falmouth volleyball team hosting Gorham. Annika Hester had a strong play throughout the match for Falmouth using both her power and finesse for points. Falmouth wins in four sets to remain unbeaten.